Hi Hair Bombshells and welcome back to my channel. It is a, another favourites video. It's I can't believe we're at the end of September already, coming into October, and it definitely feels like autumn is on, on the way. Not so much today because it is blaring sun coming through my window at the moment, but it has been very chilly and things the past couple of days. So the first thing that I've been absolutely loving this month is the... Oops. I really should have wiped this off before um, I put it in a video. But it is the MUA eyeshadow palette, palette, um, palette in Undress Me Too. It is just an amazing, amazing thing, for, especially for doing the autumnal colours and just a fabulous thing. It's neutrals and just everything that I wear this time of the year really and I'm so glad I've got it I've been wearing it every day and I've actually got actually wearing this gold one here and this one on my eyes today they are absolutely gorgeous 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 colors for autumn the next thing that I've been absolutely loving is the Rimmel lasting finish 25 hour foundation i actually got this in a shade darker than i would normally get it but uh, you to be honest you can't really tell the difference between the ivory and the soft beige i got it in 200 soft beige it's actually a very good color for my skin i tend to, i like to go a little bit warmer during the um winter months because I have a very very pale skin and look like a ghost sometimes so I have to put a little bit of life back into my skin so that is why I got this one and it claims to be 25 hours I wore it on Friday um, I was out all day didn't get home till early hours of the next day and this stayed on all day and night and I was very very naughty because I got in so late or early whatever way you want to look at it um I didn't take my makeup off and this was still on when I got up in the morning so it definitely lasts and there will be a full review coming very soon on this and uh, the next one I've been loving is a mascara and you know me I love my mascaras I do love a good mascara and this is the Avon Aero Volume Mascara in black. I actually have it on today, if you can see that. It is so, so gorgeous. I love it. it it's just a normal, normal um, wand, whatever you want to call it. But it, it seriously, it's very lightweight. You don't even know you're wearing it. And it's so easy to apply. It doesn't make you... Um, lashes clumpy and it comes off easily as well but it gives you very nice flattery flattery flat flattery lashes and I'm just I'm just loving it I've been wearing it probably every day so far it's definitely one of my absolute favorites and I would really recommend this to anyone love it, it I feel like a lot of this is Avon but um yeah I've been loving this coal eyeliner in true black because I've been oh there I oh go away sun there I've been loving a pencil liner instead of a liquid liner late, lately I just think it looks a little bit more autumnal um so I, I rate this one out of my collection so the next three I have are nail varnishes um if you follow my blog or read my blog i did a collection of my avon nail varnishes and these two were in it and i absolutely loved it i don't know if you can see the sun is too bright i don't think it's gonna do them justice i really don't think it is but they are absolutely gorgeous along with this max factor infinity one which i've had on my nails for the past for the past week this actually went up on my blog yesterday so i will link that below 
but my nails are very very tatty at the moment I did mean to redo them before I filmed this but I didn't have time but I'm absolutely loving these glitter nail polishes are going to be a real big thing for me this year in autumn I just love them I just think they look so pretty and coming up for the winter time uh, of course you get Christmas and you like to look all nice and sparkly at Christmas time so they'll definitely be getting well and truly worn and I will be getting the other colours of the Avon Stardust ones as well. On to lip products now. And oh, there are there are a fair few there, aren't there? Ah, oh, I love these. Um, This one you have seen in my videos before. I love this one. It's just a great, great colour, although it's showing up more pinky. In the light at the moment um, it's a great great color goes on effortlessly and it's really buildable it's a lovely um, cherry color for cherry color berry color for the autumn which is great because it's all about the berries this year isn't it along with this one this is the collection lip butter in four perfect plum again absolutely love this absolute must last for ages I can drink I can eat and it's still there and have I got lipstick on my teeth no makes a change one is from Rimmel it's a red lipstick funnily enough you do know I love my reds uh, it is 510 in Mayfair Lady and oh Smell. I wish this was smell of vision I don't know if anyone else has picked up on it, but Rimmel lipsticks have definitely got a smell of their own. And this just smells gorgeous to begin with. It's a fabulous red colour. Uh, my new favourite red colour, actually. Lasts ages. Um, again, stays all day. And it's just an abs absolute one that I've been loving. Uh, although I have been wearing a lot of the berry coloured lips lately if I go back to a red which I do quite a lot this is always going to be the one that I will go for from now on it's a little bit of a late arrival to me in the month but it is a Avon ultra colour lipstick I'm actually wearing it today and it is in smitten red again a lovely colour for this time of year it's not too it's not too bright a red uh, and it's not too dark it's just nice in the middle and nice in the middle color and it can be built up to however dark you want it which I normally do but I didn't today so that is all my beauty products the other thing I've been loving this month is my white Peruna jacket which I will just grab to show you this one well I say it's white but it's it's actually more creamy looking. It is gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. It's got my badges on it from when I've, from when I've been out singing my little treble cliff and my poppy there, and another one that my nan gave me there. I do love my diamonds. Um, it's just a lovely jacket for this time of year because although we're in autumn, it's not boiling hot, but it's not freezing cold it's in the middle and that's nice if you don't want to put a great big bulky coat on all the time really really well and truly warm um this month the other thing i've been loving is this necklace i actually have on today but it is gorgeous it's featured on my blog so if you want to see better pictures of it then go and check out that i've also been loving my new iPod that has been my biggest thing I've been absolutely loving I can't show you it because I'm actually filming on it today so if you think the quality of this video is better than my others then please do let me know and I shall film my videos on my iPod in future the fifth generation and I've got it in the blue and it's just been a godsend for me. I love my iPod anyway because I love it for music and this one I got in a bigger memory so I've been putting games and different apps on it and I've just been really really loving it and the picture quality is so much better. Um, my most recent pictures on my blog have been taken on here and 
to be honest, I haven't had to edit them like I used to on the old one, which I'm really, really pleased about. I can just put the normal true quality picture up without having to edit it so much, which is really, really, really nice. That is everything for my favourites this month. I hope you've enjoyed it. As I say, if the quality, if you like, prefer the quality of um, my iPod to my camera, then please do let me know in the comments below. All my links will be below. Um, I'll leave a link to my blog as well, which is always there. And you can go and check that out. You can go and check that out if you want to. And I shall see you all next week.